good shot there from Tate. Girls love money, and that's not entirely true. How long do you reckon Tristan's gonna be? I don't know where he's going, I guess he's going to borrow a car. But even if he, I don't know why he walked off so quickly, because even if he borrows a car, I still don't think it's going to allow us to make it all the way. You can't just tow an Aston, it's not that kind of car. So I don't know where he's gone, he says he knows someone. So. Does lose its cool if it's going to be towed. Not the coolest towing man. No. Mm. Thirty-four grams of sugar in an Ironbrook. Have a guess at what percentage that is of you got your daily recommended intake of sugar. Go on, waver a guess. Thirty-four G's of sugar is that's a guess. Okay, give me the signal if you think it's between ten and twenty percent. I don't care, Dave, but okay. Thirty eight percent. Is it thirty eight percent? Shocking. Yeah, Probably put that down actually, because that's just mental. No wonder Scottish have got no teeth. Shouldn't you be with Tristan right now, following him, seeing what he's doing? Kind of left without telling me. I would. Yeah. And this is good for the documentary, really. What is? Iron brew sugar fucking intake. Hmm. Well. It's important to science. You never know, you might have a hot bitch who loves an iron brew. Stop shrinking it. She will apply. Bit bitches love brew. I want that banner. For my Bit bitches love brew. <laughs> we love brew and we love you if hot. Fucking bitch. Listen, no, no, that's not the matter. Beautiful girls who want to make money via Snapchat. That's the way. Rich, what do you say? Got some nice cereals in mason jars. Very plush. Well, you got the fruit and fiber, got some shreddies, some knives, some wire. I'm missing one. Right here. Microwaveable money. Pardon, mate. Oh dear. Turns out there's someone else in here. So he was lying about the makeup. It's too bad. There's a woman in there. Really? Surprise, surprise. So you were lying about the makeup. It's too bad though, so maybe uh maybe I'll stay here. I don't think so. Hello. 
Sorry about uh, walking in on you with the what? camera. Sorry about entering the room. Um, you? Yeah. Do you speak English? No. No English. Do you like Mr. Tate? Tate? Andrew. Yes. He's nice, isn't he? A bit grumpy sometimes. Yes. Why from camera me? I don't know, just kind of filming everyone at the moment. So, uh, Luton's nice. Mm? Nice? Mm. No. No. No, not it isn't, is it? Really? Tristan's here. Gone for that. She doesn't speak much English, um, the girl, does she? Not a wordsmith. Nice coat, though. If she spoke English today, would she talk to you? Maybe. Where is it? He's got a he's got a fucking jeep. Problem solved. It's not a problem solved. It is. Heck, it's stuck in the snow in this. Look at it. Oh, you get stuck in this. It's manual as well. Four wheel drive. Yeah, this will make this will make it. It's got a tow bar. Aston, you doesn't seem to be Aston. It's because we have another oh, car. Look, look, look. Buy a tow rope, it's got a tow bar underneath. You drag the Aston to a nice, drag the Aston to a to nice, Romania. safe place, and then we can hang out in this car until they salt the roads. Problem solved. Genius. It's not genius. It is. No, because that would work maybe if, if it was a little bit snowy. It's completely so, fucked. Okay. It's in it. We leave the Aston somewhere where it's snowy. Wait for them to salt the roads for a day or two. We can always get away in this. Whose car Done. is it? Problem solved. Yours. I mean it's mine. I've got the V5 in here. I haven't filled it out yet, but I put it in my name if you like. So you just bought this? Yeah. How much was it? Less than the 10 grand that your wheels would have cost. Money saved. No. Take it back. No. Legit. This is to, yeah, I can't take it back. I, what do you think? I bought it from the dealership second hand. I'm gonna go there. He's gonna tell me to get lost. He's got my money now. Your money. Romania, here we come. Road trip. Fucking love it. Well played. Yeah. Good. Well played. That's brilliant. It's not brilliant. This is not gonna actually help us maybe any more than 10%. If the car, if it's that bad, the weather's that bad, and I, the I, Aston can stop. We can drag a tow line to it in a nice safe parking place. You probably leave place. 150 grand of the car by the side of the road. No, just leave it in Luton instead. How about that? For months. Yeah, but I'm gonna have to, I'll have to find some secure storage for it or something. This, this isn't an option. How much did this car cost? Less than the 10 grand your wheels would have cost. It's a money Give saving me my debit card. investment. <laughs> it's, a, it's a money saving investment. It's gonna be like lads on tour. It's, it's not. Stop buying things. Hey. You said, you said, and I quote, in fact, we probably have it on video, and I quote, if we had a second car, I'd be more comfortable making the trip. Yeah, it doesn't mean I was gonna do the trip. Second car. Hands are tied now, the die is cast. I'm driving the beast. The Take beast. Your <laughs> Classic. He'll be all right. He'll be all right. If he'd spent 10 grand on the wheels, he would have been happy and he would have got there, but he's fine. So Andy, are we all coming inside or? I'll bring the paperwork that you can fill out. You're gonna buy me insurance as well. Oh. 
Oh, nice. Look at the space. Yeah. That's going to be. That's, it's cooler than the Aston Martin. It's like a hotel room on wheels. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'd rather have my X6, but this will, you know, it'll make the drive down there. I'll scrap it when I get to Romania. It's a one purpose, one journey purchase. Shh. Hello. Alright, is there a coffee maker facility here? Fuck coffee. Wait a second. Because if you seriously just bought that car. Yeah. For the sake of fucking trying to look cool on a, a video, how much did it actually cost? I'm not trying to show off. How much did it cost? To anybody. I'm trying to get your car back to Romania. How much did it cost? I don't need that car. How much did it cost? Five. Five grand. Less than five. It was supposed to be five. A friend of mine sold it to me. Do you want a lime brew? Oh, I'd love one. Actually, it's got to be coffee around here. Why are you more concerned with iron brew? Do you know how much sugar's in an iron brew? Have a guess. No idea. 34 grams. I know that Iron Brew is the only, the only country in the world where the best selling drink is not a Coca-Cola product is Scotland. Because Iron Brew is made by a company called Bar. Mm. Interesting trivia for you. Guess, guess what percentage of uh, 34 grams is your daily, daily guy, yeah. 150. 38. 38, mm. Mm. In which case, have an Iron Brew. <laughs> Sebastian on the phone. Listen. Okay. His car's stuck. His car's stuck. He's a Range Rover, four yeah. wheel drive. Range Rovers are not, even the X6. Four wheel drive with winter tires. They're fashionable vehicles. That's a real off roader. That will make it. The Aston won't make it. Yeah, fine. Who parked the Aston until the roads are salted? And, and that's still out. Boom's up. That still doesn't fix anything because I'm trying to get Sebastian on the phone so I can speakerphone him. If you don't have winter tires and police stop you, they take your car's papers. It's dangerous driving. So that means I have to buy the 10 grand wheels anyway, or the Romanian police are going to stop a British Aston Martin in the snow. Nah. Obviously, they're going to stop it, and they're going to take the, the car papers oh, and shit. Come. If only the Romanian police took bribes. I mean, what a wonderful world that would I'm be. I'm not paying fucking a bribe every Bribing 10 minutes. is less than 10 grand. The bribes you'll spend is less than 10K. 100%. Get the car there, park it in the garage. Fine. Done. Dave, you're riding with Andrew. Is that going to be a bit dangerous? Nah, it's fun. Aston's a safe, Andrew's a great driver. Andrew, Dave's with you. I didn't mean the car. Hey, he's harmless. I'll send you the money back. That's my car. I'll transfer the money back. I'll sell it to some farmer when I get there. Hey, Sebastian. So if I drive on summer tires and the police stop me, it's a, it's a small fine or is it a big problem? Yeah, yeah, I know. But they're gonna stop it because it's a British car and it's an it's a Aston Martin, so they're gonna stop it. And, they're gonna, and then they're gonna want a stupid amount of bribe to not take the car away because... <laughs> They'll take the car. Okay, has the has has the has the X6 got winter tires on it? Summer, so it's okay. Okay, well, all right. Okay, all right. I'll call you back, friend. Thanks, man. They take the car. There's no way we can drive it, which means you just bought a fucking four x four for zero reason. We're gonna have to find secure storage for the Aston, leave it here, and fly there. They take the car if you have no winter tires, it's dangerous driving. I can't just bribe them to not take a 150 grand car. They're gonna want two or three grand Down for a bribe. Down to Italy, into Bulgaria, up to Bucharest, hour in Romania, max. And what about the, yeah, we don't know the laws. That's because we've got a Romanian friend. You need winter tires in Germany by law. 
Do we? You tell me. You want, you bought the car here. This is your problem. I'm trying to help. I've offered amazing assistance. You don't offer amazing mm. assistance. Here's what we're gonna do. Take that fucking car back. Get our money back. Can't take it back. No refund. Secondhand car dealership. Then what we're we gonna do with that now? Now we have two cars. Ah. Uh, Mom's boyfriend needs a car. Give it in. Get our money back for that car. We'll put the ass in storage and we'll fly. And we're just gonna have to leave the car here in storage until it until it gets warm for four months. There's no choice. But whatever, we do, you've not made the situation any better. Just spunking money on that. If we go through Italy, then we can stop off for a risotto. Andrew loves a risotto. That's a good point. That's a good point. It doesn't help 1%. There's a little happy face dangling in the window. And I've got a sad face because this car is going back to the dealership. If you'll take it back. Yes? Kickboxing champion buying to come cars in bedroom, mate. Yes. Alright. Car's going back. I think he's mad. I think we're down about 700 pounds. Because the guy knows we're in no position to haggle. So, he said I'll take it back, but how much less than I paid for? Oh well. Some of these Range Rovers are pretty nice. I was tempted to pick one of these up, but <laughs> I was using Andrew's card, he would have been furious. Plus I've got the X6, which is nicer, so. Death of the beast.